What's going on everybody? In today's video, we're gonna have a review of Elite 64 Rollins and Cena. Over the next couple of days, we're gonna be having a review on all of Elite 64. We're gonna go two by two. Um, so let's get started with Rollins and Cena. All right guys, let's take a look at the packages of both of these bad boys. So, we got the front. The side, good images of both, both fighters. Got the back and you guys can pause the video here if you wanna get a good read at the descriptions on the bottom. And then we got the names once again. All right, let's see if we get these guys cracked open. All right guys, so first off, we'll start with Rollins here. So he has, I believe what was, it was his Rumble attire where he had the flame on his pants. Um, solid design work by Mattel. Um, it definitely captured every last flame, probably as perfectly as they could. We have the, the SR on the knee pad there. Um, I will say they definitely, you know, improve with this Rollins, Rollins head scan, solid head scan. Um, either way, regardless. Um, I do think that they've definitely improved the work they've done on the title belts with the tag belts. I think it's definitely a shinier, as you can see in the light here. Um, definitely looks more like the, as you see on TV, tag titles um, as far as articulation goes you guys can see I mean definitely all the joints are good no no issues here with the joints um, arms are good um, torso is all set no issues with the head either so yeah solid figure all around um, you know it's really kind of just your basic set it just has you know flaming pants on it with nothing too too special but um, a solid design. I, I saw plenty of you guys customize this figure. Um, but yeah, I mean, it comes with the interchangeable hands too. This is the first figure I have with the interchangeable hands. Uh, the next up, we have the John Cena. So I believe this is um, one of the first few times we've had the, the new boots here. Or I should say shoes. But the, uh, the tap out shoes, I know he's sponsored by them. Um, and the first time we have the open, you can't see me hands, which I thought was... All right, heel dog just got in the way there, bumped the uh, tripod. Um, but yeah, as I was saying, I thought the uh, the hands here, solid addition. The fact that if you're doing stop motion, you can now do that you can't see me in front of people. I mean, that's nuts. Um, I know I've been waiting for that for a while, so that's really cool to see, honestly. Um, I mean, yeah, the shirt, the same, you know, solid. I will give them a tell this. When they give us cloth shirts, they're always solid. They always feel perfect. The, the designs always come out pretty damn clear. Um, and then when the with the rest scene of the uh, the hand, the the uh, sorry the um, the uh, rest the wristbands are solid, um, no problems on this one as well. I just I love the detail that they that can give Cena and other figures when they want to, uh, when it's necessary. It comes with the uh, the dog tags as well. But yeah, overall, you know, another solid figure. I think uh, regardless, we'll, we'll take the um, we'll stop off him real quick. Uh, the fact though, you know, that we get. The interchangeable hands with the shirt on top of the um, the hat and everything else is just a really really solid um, you can see a bit of the underwear and then the um, the belt you know the solid design work on the belts as well um, I will say again you know classic Mattel quality control um, you know giant spot in the head there um, there's a bigger spot there as well on top of the head but you know other than that I can't really I can't complain too too much. Um, solid all around. Um, if I were to give these two a rating, I think this is probably one of the better Cena's. They're finally really. I mean, it's nothing, not a lot to Cena, but definitely a killer figure for him. Um, then, as far as Rollins goes, you know, just to have. He comes out with so many new attires, but just to have that, you know, one of his more well known attires, I should say in figure form is always great. I mean, it does suck when I see all you guys on Instagram make customs of these guys and then Mattel comes out and makes them. So I kind of feel bad, you know, you put in all these hours, but either way, solid figure. Um, probably a good seven out of 10 for this John. And then for Rollins, for, again, basic design, but sometimes less is more. Um, probably a good seven and a half, I would say on the Rollins. The fact that we get, you know, a solid attire on top of a belt great head scan solid seven and a half i'll go with that um so catch us out in the next video guys peace